Hi guys, Rory here from Your Golf Travel. Uh, it's Christmas party day here at YGT. This jumper is a joke in case any of you are wondering. So I hope you all enjoyed the greatest 18 match from Andalusia in Spain uh, and the hybrid kind of bonus footage that's coming out at the moment. Um, as we usually do on these filming trips, myself, Mark and Matt sat down at the end of the five days in Spain, having done these 18, 19 courses, thousands of miles of driving, etc, etc, to talk about um, our favourite courses, courses that kind of surprised us on the trip. Um, as I said in some of the videos already, that we kind of did a cross section of the area of Andalusia, so we did some of the top ranked courses which were quite expensive, right down to some really affordable ones. So yeah, so we chatted about ones which we were better than we expected they might be, um, and also so what kind of golfers might enjoy a trip to Andalusia. Right guys, so we flew into Seville the other day, five days ago, 19 golf courses ago. Best course in Andalusia, both from a ranking quality wise and then like value for money, that kind of thing. Yeah. Um, so we played in places like, uh, sorry, regions like Huelva, Costa de la Luz, Costa del Sol, and finally we're here in Almeria. Um, kicked off at Islantia, finished here at Val del Est. So, so far, what do you reckon has been your favourite course out of the 19? Yeah. Um, I can't remember the names of all of them, but the one I where... I know your one. Go on. La Reserva or Finca Courtesy? Uh, both of those are just spectacular. Yeah. We're always taking a shot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Great strike. Go on, get up there. Fly, fly, fly. Oh, yeah, yeah. that's a quality shot. Rory rolls this up and it could it. end it. Stop. That oh, is a ripper. I told you. Yeah, you did. Oh, dear. Three is a half. Out, Oliver. Yes, Rory's please. just nailed that. Do not rip that one. If this was our normal three, I would be worried that he three putts from there. <laughs> <laughs> I look how down it lies. Oh, right line, it? oh, it's short. <laughs> Pick it up. <laughs> Four net three. It was quick down there. <laughs> really yours, Oliver. You did have one putt, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Hard to choose between them because they're both, one's a bit easier. Mm -hmm. La Reserva is a little easier, a bit more room. Yeah, I'd pick that one because I'd lose less gold. Yes. <laughs> Where Finca, how would you say the second one? Finca Cortison. Cortison. Um, that's like brutal tough, Yeah. but beautiful, like stunning beautiful. Wind gets up around there, you know about it, don't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. Only the best win around that course, eh, Matt? Yeah, yeah. That room, Matt. yeah, they do, yeah. <laughs> they do love a drop off par three here in Spain. It's lovely, isn't it? What are your thoughts on Finca, Matt? Awesome. I love how it's all individual, the holes, because of all the trees and bushes between each one. Memories Just... flooding back? Yeah. <laughs> back to my junior days. World stuff champion. Around here. Yeah, you know. <laughs> that is a pretty epic course. You can't see much of it from here. We're on the 10th tee now. So this was the playoff hole. Yeah. You won on this hole. I did, yeah. That is filthy. In the semi, yeah. You said, took me to the final. You said the other guy three putted, though, didn't you? On the 18th, yeah, to let me go to the playoff hole. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody likes to do that at a course like this. <laughs> no. And that's the course I would pick as well. Nostalgia. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Nostalgic yeah. reasons. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 
So, as I said, the price point of lots of the courses has been very varied. Yeah, um, we which tried is good. To, yeah, we tried to do a cross section of Andalusia, yeah. basically. Otherwise, you just go and play 18 holes at like Valderrama. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Um, so, are there any courses out of the 19 which kind of surprise you? Obviously, I probably know a bit more about certain venues than you guys do. Kind of like El, Rom El Rompido. Which is our like second venue. Two really. courses, both great, some stunning scenery, uh -huh. good hotel. That I was impressed with that. Yeah. So there's two courses there, so we're going yep. to do one on each course, and this is beautiful to start. Up just over 300 yards, downhill off the left, and that looks like marsh going into the sea. That stuff on the right that no one's going to hit their ball into. <laughs> What's great about this? Matt's going to hit that free iron again for safety. <laughs> He's cut it. He didn't start far enough left, but I think it's short enough to be fine. Down over there, you won't see it land. A long way right, is it? It's right, it's, it's right like right down the, the line of the tree line here, the, the little trees. See the little trees there? It got airborne. Oh my word. Oh no. Where do you find them, Ray? <laughs> <laughs> That's gone right. That's that is. That's that, was worse. that was worse than the other one. Well, you well, say sure. that. I Between got more, those that shots. Got more hype. Yeah. <laughs> Ray's doing the right thing and being polite. There is my partner. Hands and hips qualifies as hands in pockets. As for Oliver. That stuff on the right that no one's gonna hit their ball into. That stuff on the right that no one's gonna hit their ball into. That stuff on the right that no one's gonna hit their ball into. Tora Cabrada. Yes, yeah, that was really afternoon. good with yeah. Sevy one when he was younger. Yeah, and the Open's been there, isn't it? As yeah, well, Spanish so. Open. Yeah. So have you won it there? Yeah, yeah. That yeah I liked. Nice. Um, we didn't see a huge amount of it. But I like Monte Castillo. I know that that's ridiculously good value Which for money. Was that? The one with we played 17 for the greatest 18, then we played 18 from the raised tee. Lovely. Get left. Uh, right. Get it, Those bunkers are 300. You said, aren't they? Not seeing anything. It's just such a big drop no, from I've up here. Pretty spectacular right. hole. Uh, wait. There we go. Zoom in on those kids. <laughs> That's uh, what really is. Oh, those are some sick swans. Oh, yeah, yeah. With the water yeah, down, down left. left. Yeah. yeah. That, yeah. From what we saw of that course, that looked really good, actually. So yeah. I, would, I would go and stay and play there for peanuts. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. So massive cross-section of courses, as you said, places like Finca Courts in are really challenging. Uh, I know I uh, played well on this tour. Splash. <laughs> <laughs> that was lovely. But I would definitely lose my fair show balls if I was spraying. Absolutely. But there were other courses which were very, very playable. I mean, I take my dad to some of these courses a higher handicap because yeah. of 23. Yeah. Um, so in general, all across the board, we it's happy to say that Angelus is just has something for everyone. 100%. Oh yeah, it's such a mixture of courses for all abilities and levels and mm. whatever people want from a course as well. Yeah. From views to great conditions to room off the tee, those kind of things. Yeah. It was a real mixed bag. And there's plenty of resorts where it's just so convenient because you've got you come off the 18th green and the hotel's 50 yards away. Actually, I mean, I really like this one. Yeah, Val del S. Yeah, I mean, I thought there was plenty of room off the tee. I thought it was a friendly course, pretty course in places, mm -hmm. a bit more desert styly, which was quite a, quite nice because obviously yeah. with some of the other ones we are tree lined. Yeah. Um, so definitely facilities as well. Yeah, loads, yeah. really good practice facilities, loads of putting greens, plenty of room as yeah. well, which was nice. Mm. Um, yeah, I was impressed with this one. I'm going back to the practice facility at uh, Finca Courts in, I think, work on these new wrist angles. That was a stunning driving range. Yeah, 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 absolutely. <laughs> So there we have it guys, um, as I said I really hope you enjoyed the Greatest 18 match and I hope you enjoy the videos that are going to come out in the coming days. Um, as ever, post comments down below, I want to know which of the 18 courses we played you would most like to play. Um, I also want to know if there's any other regions or countries around the world which you would like to see this format of trip on. So, um, Greatest 18 in the Algarve anyone, maybe? 
Sounds good to me. Um, as ever, subscribe to the Your Golf Travel channel, like the video. Uh, hopefully I'll see you all soon. If I don't see you before Christmas, have a great one uh, and I'll see you in the new year. Before I go though, and I've had to leave the floor that I was on because there's people trying to bomb my video, uh, helpful colleagues as ever, click on the link below if you want 50 pounds off an Andalusia golf holiday if you're booking in the future.